everyone welcome back to my channel today i've got some cool updates to share all about the nvidia rtx series and the incredible journey that followed my latest video so let's dive right in recently i created a video showcasing the powerful capabilities of the rtx 5090 and to my surprise it caught the attention of the awesome folks over at zotac they liked my work and that got me invited to an exclusive NVIDIA RTX AI training session. I was also fortunate enough to get hands-on experience of Zotac's high-end GPUs, witnessing firsthand their sheer power and performance. If you've ever wondered how these modern games look so lifelike and how these content creators push out high-quality content, then this video is for you. We are exploring NVIDIA's AI-driven features from the very first RTX to the latest and the greatest. We will learn how DLSS, ray tracing, and frame generation works. We'll also explore how NVIDIA software offerings from broadcast to canvas, omniverse, and studio works. Whether you're a gamer or a creator or just curious, this video is for you. Turing Architecture, the start of RTX. Back in 2018, Turing Architecture was launched with G4 RTX 2000 series and it changed the game, literally. Here's what was new. It started with CUDA cores. Now, imagine CUDA core is like small hands that paint the graphics on your screen. They are responsible for the graphics on your screen to all high-level computations. Second, your RT cores. Now, RT cores are responsible for ray tracing, which simulate reflections, lighting, and shadows. And third, your tensor cores. Now, tensor cores are like AI assistants that handle all the deep learning tasks like your DLSS. With Turing architecture, gamers got to experience the real life ray tracing for the very first time. And it was like switching from a standard TV to a HDTV. There was no going back. DLSS, deep learning super sampling. Now, DLSS might sound intimidating. So here's a simpler version of it. Imagine you have a drawing, but it is much smaller than you want it to be. Now, it is easier to color a smaller drawing, right? That's what DLSS does. Your game runs at a lower resolution internally, speeding up the performance. Then, tensor cores kicks in, and they upscale the image to a higher resolution, using a deep learning model that is trained on high-quality images. In return, you get close to native visuals at a much higher frame rate. So cool, right? It's like taking a photo on your phone and then using an AI filter to upscale it to a much crisp and professional camera shot. What's not to love? Okay, what is ray tracing? Simply speaking, ray tracing is realistic lighting for everyone. Ray tracing simulates how light behaves in the real world. So get this, before ray tracing, developers had to fake the lighting using clever tricks. Now, the light bounces around in real time. RT cores are the specialized cores behind this. They handle the heavy math so that your other GPU processes don't get overloaded. Now let's talk about RTX 4000 series. The latest Ada Lovelace architecture powers the RTX 4000 series. Now what has improved? 4th Gen Tensor Cores The 4th Gen Tensor Core powers the DLSS 3, which has introduced new techniques like frame generation. Frame generation literally generates new frames between the existing ones, giving you a better frame rate. The 3rd Gen RT Cores has proven to give you enhanced ray tracing in real-time path tracing. That wraps up our tool for NVIDIA's AI-powered GPU features. We've discussed how DLSS, ray tracing, and frame generation enhances your gaming experience. NVIDIA just doesn't make hardware. They have a massive software ecosystem that uses AI to make gaming, content creation, and streaming easier and more powerful. Let's break it down. First off, we have NVIDIA Broadcast. With real-time noise removal, AI automatically filters out background sounds like keyboard clicks or a noisy fan, so your voice stays crystal clear. With virtual background and auto-framing, broadcast can simulate a green screen and keep you centered in the frame, even if you move around. Why it matters? Whether you're in a Zoom meeting, streaming or Twitch, or recording a podcast, you get professional quality audio and video without expensive gear. Secondly, we have NVIDIA Canvas, which is AI-driven painting. You paint simple shades or blobs of color 
then canvas instantly converts them into a realistic image of mountains, clouds, water and more. With rapid concept art, if you are a game developer or an aspiring digital artist, you can sketch ideas quickly and on the breeze. No advanced painting skills are required. With improved real-time ray tracing and physics, you can preview how lighting, material and physics will look in the final scene without long render time. It is great for studios, architects and indie dev teams who want to visualize projects immediately and make changes on the fly. And lastly, we have NVIDIA Studio. It is a creator-focused driver, specially tuned drivers for creative apps like Adobe Premiere, After Effects, Blender and DaVinci Resolve. NVIDIA Studio has got it all. So you can spend more time creating and less time waiting because every minute you save on rendering is a minute you invest back in your project. All these software features shows that NVIDIA is not just about pushing more pixels in game. They are here to enhance your overall experience, whether you are creating, gaming or just chatting with your friends. So from your home gaming rig to the biggest AI labs in the world, the same technology, CUDA cores, RT cores and Tensor cores are fueling innovation everywhere. Don't forget, you can experience all of this on your Zotac RTX cards.